Hello, everybody. Welcome, fellow food lovers. Um, I wanted to talk about beef ribs today. I think I've talked about them in the past, but I'm here in Sun Valley, California, and nearby in Burbank, there's a restaurant called Wood Ranch. It's a chain, but it's pretty darn good. And the one thing I always get when I go there is are their barbecue beef ribs. I, they are the best that I've found anywhere. And I was looking for, you know, a copycat recipe. Haven't been able to find it, but I found this that looks good and um, easy. Um, <clears throat> easier than cooking on the, on the grill, on the barbecue. Uh, they're actually cooked in the oven um, at, and the, the website is the Poor Man's Gourmet Kitchen. So I go by, as you know, I, you know, I'm attracted to good food photography and something that looks appetizing at first and that I want to try. So um, <clears throat> get the beef ribs, um, as he says, and you know, you'll see everything, you know, um, that it's not barbecue. But in, in the rub that he uses, which is a rub that... Um, also used for uh, brisket, it has smoked paprika. If you want the smoky flavor of a barbecue, you know, add some some liquid smoke. Um, but you know, you cook it for three about three hours. I mean, it's like set it and forget it, like he says. So here's a rack of beef ribs, salt, pepper. Um, here's the rub recipe. So this is pretty. Uh, Pretty simple too. Um, you can go to this page and look at the brisket recipe, but um, smoked paprika, salt, pepper, sugar, chili powder, cumin, garlic, and onion powder. And let's see. So you just rub it and heat it for, uh, bake it for three hours at 300. And then if you're adding barbecue sauce, as he says, you know, do it for the last 10 minutes. Chinese barbecue sauce. P.F. Chang's China Bistro Recipe. Now this is a copycat recipe, and he's, he's, this is might be a little um, on the sweet side compared to the Wood Ranch things. Uh, ketchup, poison, plum sauce, sugar. Um, yeah, it's going to be on the sweet side. So, tend to to like something up, you know, just a little bit of tang, but uh, some more smoky flavor. So it's up to you. But with just the rub and the oven, um, you can you can rub it, put it in the oven for three hours at 300, and that's it. So very simple and very delicious looking. So with um, you know another tip for barbecued beef ribs, give this a try. This is Jose Meyer in Sun Valley, California. I'll see you guys next time.